This is World Media Cafe. As the effects of the failure of the offshore cryptocurrency exchange featuring continue to spread, the crypto lender BlockFi has become the most significant operator in the market to file for bankruptcy. BlockFi claims to have $256.9 million in cash on hand. It operates similarly to a traditional bank, paying interest on savings and using customer deposits to fund lending. According to court records, among its creditors are the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission, SEC, to which it owes $30 million, and featuring itself, to whom it owes $275 million. BlockFi said in a statement that it had filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy. This action follows the shocking events surrounding featuring and associated corporate entities and the difficult but necessary decision we made as a result to pause most activities on our platform. Since the pause, our team has investigated all of the strategic options and alternatives available to us while maintaining a laser-like focus on our main goal of providing the best service possible for our clients. These Chapter 11 cases will give BlockFi the chance to stabilize the company and complete a reorganization plan that maximizes value for all parties involved, including our cherished clients. The SEC fined the company $100 million for breaking securities laws in February, claiming that the investment products it provided qualified as unregistered securities. Evidently, the unpaid portion of that fine is the $30 million debt that is still outstanding. In the wake of the spring's cryptocurrency crash, BlockFi has already come dangerously close to filing for bankruptcy once this year. Following the company's chief executive Zach Prince's declaration that additional funding was necessary to prevent a liquidity crisis, the company signed a deal with none other than featuring giving it access to $400 million in loans. With a peak valuation of $3 billion, the deal's price was an option from featuring to purchase the lender for about $240 million. See you in our next video.